Being a Harrison Wildcat means performing to the best of my ability and putting myself in many different positions that Harrison High School offers. I've attended Southwest School since kindergarten. I went to Crosby Elementary and I worked my way up through the junior high and now I'm in the high school. Looking back at my time as a Wildcat, what stands out most to me in my education is the teachers I've had. All the teachers at in Southwest local schools are great teachers. And I think that this levy needs to be passed so that the students have the resources they need to perform to the teacher standards and be the best that they can be. One aspect of Southwest local schools I think could be updated is our technology. We're competing with kids from other schools who have all the updated technology. And in our future, um, all of these jobs have a lot of, to deal with a lot of technology, so I think to be prepared for the real world, we need to update our technology to match what the changing environment is. Education has changed even since when I was in kindergarten. Nowadays, there's computers and technology used in every grade, and our buildings don't have the infrastructure to support that. So that needs to be changed, and with this school levy, it will be. When competing against kids from other schools through programs like DECA and other sports, I've noticed that those schools have a lot of space to do a lot of great things. And with the overcrowding here in our district, Southwest Local Schools, I think it hinders our opportunity for growth academically and socially. So by updating our um, facilities, I think that this could be a very positive thing for the future of Southwest Local Schools. Harrison High School has prepared me for the next phase of my life. It has given me many opportunities to grow as a person and grow into the real world. In order to keep those opportunities present for all the future generations, we need to update our facilities and keep those opportunities growing with the ever-changing society.